Hello people, this is Dr. Dirtak. I have a prescription for you. Escape. Yeah, <laughs> it's a great Dirtak tool. Uh, it's a li Linux utility to configure modifier keys to act as other keys when pressed and released on their own. Yeah, that sounds weird, I know. Um, and what we're gonna do is, uh, because my favorite key, my absolute favorite key on the keyboard is caps lock. Because caps lock is, is placed on the be probably the best position on the whole keyboard. It's at, at, at the furthest uh, uh, left on the home row. It's a very, very good position. But it have a very useful uh, function, caps lock, to make uh, all, all uh, letters uppercase, you know. Uh, my younger brother, <laughs> he even he, he 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 hated caps lock so much. So he he removed the the key from his keyboard. He always uh, all his keyboards uh, didn't have a caps lock key because he hated to uh, press caps lock by mistake while while he was gaming gaming or something. Uh, but for me, as a dirt attacker, caps lock is the best key. Because you can remap the key to add some cool and good functionality or smart uh, functionality. And there is even uh, a kind of a uh, conspiracy, or, or how to say it, that, that the, the, the old, old school engineers who, who, who created the keyboard layout, they added this, this uh, useless functionality to the key just uh, f for the reason to, to, uh, to remap it to, to something else. But who knows? Whatever. But that's what we're gonna do, and we're gonna use escape uh, is one one of the ingredients in in this dirt hack. You can get escape um, um, from GitHub here, and just making it, uh, it, it it's a very small C program. But if you have Arc, then it's available in in the repositories, and it's even available in. Um, uh, the default repository, so you don't have to recite to, to AUR. It's available in community here. So you can just install this, um, and I only use it for one single remapping. And I have a, haven't uh, really described what it does. Also, what it does is you can you can add a double functionality to modify fire keys first and foremost. Maybe the most common thing is to to add it to um, to control. So if you uh, hold control and press a different key, you know, then control is a modifier key. And uh, yeah, control uh, F, for example, that's often find in, in a document. But if you just tap the control key without uh, uh, pressing any other key, you just tap it as a single key, then nothing happens us usually. And this is what e escape does. It gives you the, the ability to, to add functionality when you just tap these uh, uh, modifier keys. For example, control or shift or alt or super key or caps lock. And I know that you can do hacks to, to also add the functionality to the spacebar. Uh, and here, this guy, uh, the developer here. If you don't understand why anybody would want this, I'm guessing that Vim is not your favorite text editor. <laughs> And you have a very good point there. I, 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 if this wasn't available, if, if I couldn't do this, I, I don't think I would use Vim. If I would have to uh, press the, the normal escape button every time I wanted to escape out into control mode. Because that is very inconvenient. You have to move your, your hand all, all the way up to the escape key, you know. I know some people are bragging, saying that they can uh, just uh, touch, uh, hit escape with their pinky while uh, while keeping the rest of their fingers on the home row, but no, you don't do that. You get your hand all the way up there, you know, and it's uh, that that's not good at all. You will lose your your uh, muscle focus or or hand focus, finger focus, whatever. And this is how easy it is. You just add escape e caps lock equal escape, and then uh, escape will 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 get executed when caps lock is is uh, tapped by itself. But then you might ask, but caps lock when you tap caps lock that is not like control because when you tap caps lock then you activate caps lock, and that is true. 
But if you use this command also, and the, the, this is a, um, I think it's built into Xorg or something. It's it, it, this command uh, lets you manipulate the the keyboard layout. Uh, it only works in X. Does it doesn't work uh, outside uh, Xorg, for example, in the TTY or something. Uh, but if you just execute it with this command here, uh, layout us here, that will set the us keyboard layout on my keyboard. But I could also write sc here, and then I would have Swedish layout. But you can also add some options to this command. And this option, caps colon control modifier, that will sh uh, change the, the functionality of the caps lock key to be a, a, a control key instead. But it will keep... Uh, it will not remap the key, it will just change the function of the key. So, so it's still recognizable as caps lock from uh, other programs like, like uh, uh, what's it called, xmodmap or what, what it's called, or, uh, and also xscape here, for example. So with these two commands, uh, then um, caps lock will be both a control key and escape key. That's much better, in my opinion, than the normal caps lock behavior. And especially if you are using Vim. But also, with this control modifier, it's also very good when you are using, for example, Emacs, where you are using control key all the time. But you, no matter when, it's always better to use caps lock as a control key than the control key itself. You, you, you just put your fingers, uh, put your pinky on the uh, caps lock key, and um, your index finger on F, for example. Control F. Feels, feels kind of good, you know. Or even uh, uh, pinky on, on control and then your, your right index finger on, on J, for example. You see, the, the, this is nice. But having your pinky on the normal control, the, the furthest uh, um, left key on, on the bottom row, the normal left control key, you know, then you, you get completely off from the home row. The, uh, adding getting used to using caps lock as the control modifier as uh, trust me this 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 have improved my my typing efficiency a lot feels really good and the caps lock on the control that's just pure gold um and you just enter these commands i, I recommend you set setting them in in your xinit file i actually have them here in this seba script here which is uh, um, because I don't use the US layout, I actually use this uh, command instead, seba, which is a combination of US keyboard. So it, it, it's just as a normal US layout. But if I hit this uh, right alt key, then I can write the Swedish uh, letters on, as well and some other extra, extra things with this. And then I also add this uh, caps lock modifier. I also have this xbanish key, uh, xbanish program. Uh, what that does is that it will hide the mouse cursor as soon as I start typing on the keyboard. So it hi hides the mouse cursor and as soon as I touch the mouse the, the cursor is back. And I, I really like that functionality. And xbanish is the one that have worked best for me. I know there's one that's called unclutter but this works much better in my opinion at least uh, on i3 and in this setup. Um, and I have put all of these uh, these three, uh, setting the layout, uh, escape and xbanish here in one script. And I reload these uh, these things uh, because I need to do so some, sometimes when I unplug and, and, uh, my, my keyboard, my physical or my me mechanical keyboard. I only have a laptop. That's the only computer I have. And I often bring it outside and uh, take it with me, you know. And then I unplug the keyboard. And then I uh, sometimes when I change keyboard like that. It forgets uh, the, either the SIBA layout and sometimes this, uh, I, I need to restart them. So I just have this script handy so I can just type SIBA and then it will restart all, all of those uh, processes here. But uh, yeah, that's what I wanted to show you. And th this is, uh, if you're using Vim or about to use Vim, I, I, I can't recommend this uh, escape enough. It's great. And you can do other cool things as well. I, I often see uh, questions uh, about, uh, you know, in Windows, if you press Windows key, that pops up the start menu, you know. There's no good way to do uh, something like that in, in uh, i3. For example, maybe you wanted uh, a Rofi menu. 
when you just press the window uh, super key or the windows key. Uh, you could do uh, something like that with escape here. You could remap uh, uh, tapping the super key to 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 something and and uh, that in turn uh, uh, start a rofi or whatever you want to do. I say thank you for watching. Um, I'm Dr. Dirtak. I will be back with more weird, weird stuff. But this will be great, uh, a, a great tip to have when when you are trying to follow uh, Budrich uh, upcoming vintage uh, videos here. Uh, so, thank you for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.